guys, we're back again. We're coming to the tail end. We've got a few more to go, but please get excited because obviously this stuff here is some great stuff. Very, very valuable for you, okay? Now, we're going to talk about how to close and overcome objections after a person has seen or heard a presentation. We talked about in a previous module, uh, we talked about these objections, but that was from an, invi from an invitation standpoint. When you invite people to come and see or hear something, that objections come up. But also, after the meeting is over, I don't think it's as simple as you just do a presentation and people whip out the credit cards. No, 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 they're gonna have some objections. That's just the nature of the beast. Before I get into this, I wanna make sure you understand, it's very important, if you are placing people on a conference call or a website, it's very important that you edify, okay, your expert and do a three-way call with them, okay? If you're physically present at a meeting, and let's say I was doing a meeting or maybe your upline executive is doing a meeting for you, okay? At the end of the meeting, you want to bring your prospect up to the expert. Whatever you do, do not say, hey, Mr. Expert, come on over here. Let me meet, let you, I want you to meet my buddy uh, Dan. No, do not ever do that. Remember, you, you show respect, you bring the prospect up to the expert, okay? It's very, very important. When you bring the prospect up to the expert, you say, hey, Bob, this is Mr. Fulcher. Mr. Fulcher, this is Bob. You know, this is, this is Bob's first time taking a look at it. And you don't say anything else. Always remember, guys, the expert is an expert for a reason. They know exactly what it is you want. So all you need to do is introduce the prospect to the expert and watch the expert do what they do best. Okay? And so here's what I want to do. I want you to put in your mind, we're at the end of a meeting, you know, the meeting is over now, the applications have gone out, and a couple things you want to do. After the meeting is over, as soon as the speaker has said his last words, very important here that you turn on some, some pretty mid-sized music. Turn on the music immediately. Okay, you must break up the room. People have just sat through a 30, 45 minute meeting. As soon as the, the expert has finished speaking, Music comes on right away, okay? And what you want to do, Rob, if you could follow me with the camera here, what you want to do is I'm going to demonstrate with you exactly what you want to do. Let's say the meeting is now over and obviously your guests are sitting down. What you want to do is you want to go over to your, pros to your prospect. Hey, Bob, glad you could make it. That's some great information. Thank you. Hey, listen, I'd like to, I want to introduce you to Mr. Fulcher privately. You got a second? Sure. Come on, come on. And what you want to do is you just basically want to, as you shake your hand of your get, your prospect, you want, to, you want to bring them up to your actual expert. And if you notice here, what I typically do is I want to make sure, I want to make sure that my back is to the audience, is to the group. Because I don't know what, what it is that this guy is getting ready to say to me, but I want to shield my prospect from everyone else that's at the meeting. Because I, I don't know what it is he's about to say. One of the things that you never want to do is you never want to answer questions at the end of a meeting publicly. Answer all questions privately. Okay? All right? So, you guys, notice what I just did? One more time. Let's try it again, Bob. Just because just, just, just I want to make sure everybody gets it. So, the meeting is now over. Hey, Bob, I appreciate you. Hey, good glad you came out. Hey, listen, yeah. I'd like to introduce you to uh, our speaker, Mr. Fulcher. You got a second? Sure. Hey, come on up. Come on up. And I bring him on up. And if you notice here, our backs are turned towards the audience so they can't really hear what it is that we're discussing, because I don't know what he may say. You know, okay? All right, thanks again. All right, now, what we're gonna do now, guys, let's, let, I wanna show you how to handle these objections, okay? Uh, don't worry, you got, some of you will need to practice at this, so don't try and be an expert at first glance, that's why we have experts. But I do want to have, I did wanna have some videos, so that you can see that you're only gonna get these six objections typically. These are the most common six objections in the entire industry. And as I've said previously, the moment you learn how to successfully, uh, confidently overcome these objections, the floodgates open to you financially. You get stone cold rich, okay? Now, so let's go ahead and what we're gonna do is I'm gonna bring up some of my colleagues and business partners and I'm gonna let each one of them throw one of these objections at me, okay? Please remember the meeting is now over, I'm now talking to them and I want you to watch what it is that I say because this is what you should be saying to your prospect at the end of the meeting. First person I'm gonna call, I'm gonna call Gaylord. Come on up here, Gaylord. You guys have already met Gaylord in a previous modules, uh, prior you know, uh, module, so we don't need to introduce him again. 
We're just going to pick it right up. This is exactly what I say. So Gaylor is now up in front of me at the end of the meeting, and this is what I'm saying. Man, it's definitely a pleasure to meet you. Pleasure. Oh, it's great to be here. Awesome, awesome. Where are you from? I'm originally from uh, New York. New York? Man, what are you doing out here in Sacramento? Well, business brought me out here. You know, I definitely I follow the money. You follow the money? I follow the money. I like what you're saying already. Well, tell me, man, uh, did, 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 did the concept, did it, you know, did it make some sense? Did you get it? Oh, I did. It, it was incredible, especially information about the coffee industry itself. Okay. Yeah. So, so what, which part was your favorite part? What did you like the best? Well, you know, like I said, I follow the money. So it was that potential for making that amount of money. Making the money. I didn't realize that. Awesome, awesome. So as it relates to making money, if I was willing to help you, how much, uh, you know, how much money would you need to make to, to make this worth your while, your first 30, 60 days? Oh, I'd say about five thousand dollars. Okay. Okay. Now, to make an extra five thousand dollars a month, uh, would you be willing to follow some simple instructions to make an extra five thousand dollars a month? Sure. Okay. Sure. All right. Mm -hmm. And if I was willing to work with you, would you be willing to be coachable to, to make an extra five thousand dollars a month? I think so. So you would work with me directly? Yeah. As, as long as you're willing to be coachable, I would. Oh yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. Well, the first instruction I would have for you. Are you ready for the instructions? All right, to make an extra $5,000 a month, uh, what I'm going to need you to do is put together a list of contacts of everybody you know, probably about 100 people, name, phone number, all over the world. Can you do that for an extra five grand a month? I think so. Okay. Yeah, you can give it, give it your best shot? Be able to. Okay, good deal. Don't. Be okay, well, come as close as you can to that, okay? All right, and then the second thing, to make an extra $5,000 a month, I'm going to want you to go ahead and... Uh, and, and introduce all of those people on that list. Mm -hmm. Just basically introduce them to me. I'm going to do all the talking. I'll do all the heavy lifting. I'll explain everything, answer their questions, work with them, etc. Because see, it's your first month, so you're kind of in training. Okay? So you're basically just going to introduce all of the people to me. Can you handle that for an extra five grand? I can do that. Okay, good. Mm -hmm. And then thirdly, what I'm going to want you to do is I'm going to want you to make all of your money back uh, within the first 72 hours. So what I'm going to do uh, is I'm going to teach you how to pre sell uh, you know, 30 boxes of the coffee that you're about to sign up for. Okay. I'm going to show you how to pre-sell 30 of them to make a quick 900 bucks in the next 72 hours. That way we'll make $900 in the next 72 hours or less. And then we'll make up the other 4100 throughout the month. You okay with that? Yeah, that seems reasonable. So again, I want to make sure you understand it's very simple. It's as simple as you following my instructions, which are building a list of contacts, introducing me to all your people, and I'm going to show you how to put 900 of the 1300 that you're about to spend back in your pocket immediately. Does that make sense? It does. Last thing to tell you, man, to have me working with you and to help you make an extra 5000 your first month, gold pack is essential. Is there anything, is there anything, any reason that would stop you from getting started at the gold pack if I showed you how to make 1300 uh, 900 of it right back in 72 hours? Uh, generally, no. Okay. But um, as I've said before, you know, being from New York, New Yorkers are tough. So we tend to want to go and do some research for now. Okay. You, know, you present it very well, but you know, I've got to go do my research. I'm, Not a problem. I work with an attorney, you know, we, we do research. Got it. I can completely understand. So research, that's the only thing that left for you to, to do before you go ahead and position yourself? Is that what I'm hearing? Pretty much, yeah. Okay. Yeah. As a, and I completely understand, no problem at all, okay? Uh, listen, as it relates to research, what specific research do you have at the top of your mind that you're kind of fishing for? Because I want to direct you in the proper areas, primarily because we're a privately held company. Mm -hmm. And I happen to know all the inner workings of the company, so I'm in front of you now. Yeah, I know you need to do the research, but tell me, what are some of the things in your mind that you're thinking that you may want to uncover? Well, honestly, I haven't done anything in this uh, industry. This is, you mentioned network marketing, I think you said. Uh, yeah. That's yeah. not something I've okay. done before. So. Okay. Uh, I need to do a little bit more to understand. Okay. So, so really the research you're fishing for is not so much just about our company. It's really about how this kind of industry works. Yes. yes I, I yes. can appreciate that. I remember I had my first time years ago, so I understand what you mean. Well, I'll tell you what. There's a couple of things that I can actually give you that will actually be perfect for what it is you're looking for. As a matter of fact, it's a DVD. It's a third-party DVD, and it doesn't talk about our company at all. All it is is going to explain from cradle to grave the details of how this industry works because that is what you're saying that you really want to understand, right? 
Yeah, absolutely. Okay. Absolutely. Yeah, because it's a viable industry. It's been around for 60 years. I know you're new to it, but it, it's been around for years, billions of dollars of you know generating the industry, but I want it to make sense to you. But I want to be clear, is that the only thing uh, as far as research that you want to pretty much uncover, just how the industry works and so forth? Is that it? Yeah, I, I would say that too. Okay, I'll tell you what. So, what do you need? Probably maybe a day or two, or no more than two two days. You said it, uh, the video. Uh, it's a video, it's thirty, it's thirty thirty minute video. What do you need? About a day or two to kind of mold sure, over? Sure, I can do that tomorrow. Okay, good. I tell you what. I'll make sure you get your hands on this DVD. I'll make sure I give it to you. Okay. Uh, but then also, I want you to know something that's very important. Above and beyond your research, because the research is going to check out, and you'll see some people make money and some people don't. It's all based upon you know what a person makes of it. No different than your profession, right? Oh, absolutely. Okay. Uh, but the most important thing in this entire industry is who it is you work with. I have to be candid with you. You're telling me you want to make five thousand your first month. Uh, how long have you been on your job uh, prior? Oh, we're looking at six years. Got okay. legal profession. Six years. Okay. Uh, well, typically, most people that come, you know, most people don't make five thousand dollars their first month in their own business. Maybe on a job if they qualify, but not typically on their own business. So I, I'll be honest, it's not. But it's possible, and it can't happen when you're working with some of the right people. Okay. So I can tell you that between myself and my partners, we have helped a lot of people achieve what it is that you want to achieve. So you're in front of someone that has done it and have taught other people how to do it. Okay. Right. So that just make sure. If I were you, I'd put a little asterisk by what I just said because this is probably the most important part of your research, who it is you get a chance to work with and what their level of commitment is to you and also their, their ability to perform. You know I appreciate saying? that because uh, Bob invited me and you know, I respect Bob. So, mm -hmm. uh, yeah, yeah that, that's, that, I will keep that. Awesome, man. Well, I look forward to uh, giving you this DVD. Okay. And I tell you what, let's, let's, let's agree to, why don't we go ahead and agree to because I'm really busy and I'm imagine you are, right? Oh, absolutely. Why don't we go ahead and set a time that works best for both you and I so we can talk, you know, after you take a look at the video and maybe have some questions and stuff. Okay. Okay, yeah, I'm thinking uh, I've got Tuesday, uh, today is Sunday, so what about Tuesday, morning or afternoon is work for you? Uh, morning would be better. Morning, how about Tuesday, 9.30? Perfect. Perfect. Gaylord, it's such a pleasure to meet you, brother. Good nice to talk. You too. Tuesday, 9.30. Take care. Here's the DVD. Thank you. Damn. That's how you can handle that objection. His objection was research. He needs to do more research. Guys, obviously you saw everything I did, so you can watch it again and again. Okay, I'm going to call someone else up. They're going to give me another objection. I want you to see how we handle that. Okay? Come on here, Bob. This is Bob. <laughs> We've been talking about Bob all day. All right? So we're at the end of the meeting. Bob, definitely uh, definitely nice to meet you, man. Nice to meet you. Uh, tell me, man, what did you like the best about what you heard and saw here today? I'm probably uh, interested in the product because of the benefits of the product. The product. Yeah. You know, that was my favorite part, too. I saw all the health properties and all the testimonials of how people were affected from it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, are you a big-time coffee drinker? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Do, yeah. Come and cup in the morning, you know, or maybe one in the afternoon. Awesome. 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 Well, okay. So is it just the product from a customer standpoint that you're interested in? Are you also interested in actually making money while drinking coffee, yeah, too? Definitely interested in making money. Yeah. Okay. Well, great. Uh, what do you say? Are you, what do you say if we helped you make a few extra thousand dollars a month? Is that something that uh, you had in mind, or was it much more or less? Uh, probably more. A little bit more? more yeah. What are you thinking? Where's the sky? Hot sky is yeah. Got it. Okay. Well, tell me, is there anything that's stopping you from actually positioning yourself today uh, on the team? Is there anything that's holding you back? You know, one of the things is uh, I, I really don't have the money. Is that okay, just the money? Yeah. I can yeah. understand. Is that the only thing, though? Is there any, is, is there anything else other than that? I don't think so. I so, think so what you're basically so, saying yeah. is, what you're basically saying is that uh, if you had the money, you, 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 you'd be involved right now. Right. Let me ask you a question. Obviously, I know that it doesn't feel too good not to have money. Am I right? Especially if you see something around you. Yeah. 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 I've, I've been there, so I can relate. But if I help you come up with the money, show you some alternatives, come up with the money, and I showed you how to make uh, two thirds of all the money that you're about to spend right back in less than 72 hours. Uh, would that make things a little bit better for you to come up with the money? Well, how would you do it? Well, you know, we have a way, because our product is coffee and it's priced so economically, we have a way of being able to pre-sell it and actually make $900 really quick in a matter of a couple of days simply calling in some favors, getting people to buy a few boxes. It's something that's very customary around here. Everybody does it. And I can tell you that uh, being the fact that you don't have any, any money, I'm sure you've got a lot of motivation 
to come up with some money if I show you a vehicle that'll help you, right? Yeah, I think so. Okay. I, mean, yeah, I think so. So if I actually helped you, if, if I actually showed you how to actually come up with nine hundred bucks in the next few in the next few days or so, would that help you have a little bit more confidence in getting started or yeah. parting with the yeah. money? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'll tell you what, man. I tell you what we'll do. I'll, I'll be willing to do this for you. Uh, as soon as let me get through talking to these other people, I'll step aside and I'll show you how to quickly, easily just pre-sell a box or two over the phone, just so you can see what I'm talking about. Uh, upon doing that, once me showing you how to actually pre-sell a box or two, uh, once you see that, are you ready to go ahead and actually get yourself positioned? Yeah, I, I think so. Okay. Yeah. And I'll be helping you, so this won't be the last you see of me. This is actually like the beginning of our relationship. Well, it's not like the last company I was with? No. Oh, okay. No. This is something where we're going to be ongoing, because obviously I know if I help you uh, make some extra money, it's going to mean a lot to you, right? Yeah. And obviously you're going to want to pay it forward to other people, right? Correct. Got it. So let me finish talking to the rest of the people. I'm going to step aside, show you how to basically pre-sell a box or two really quickly, and then go ahead, and while, I, and while I'm still talking, if you don't mind, just start filling out the application okay, while you're sitting over there. Okay. And then I'll okay. be with you in just a few moments to show you how to pre-sell your first two boxes, okay? All right. Awesome. Thank you. Okay. So, guys, I hope you can hear my voice uh, over there. I'm hoping that you guys still hear me. Maybe I'll talk a little bit louder, but that objection was he didn't have any money. Let's bring up the next person, okay? Come on up, Julie. All righty. So nice to meet you, Julie. Are you guys noticing a common theme? Julie, tell me. What is it that you like best about what you saw here tonight? I really like the opportunity. I mean, I, I was a little skeptical coming, but mm -hmm. I wasn't really sure what I was going to see. But I think when it said coffee and he showed me the industry, it was a no-brainer. Mm -hmm. You know, I was the same way. The opportunity is exactly what got me. It made sense. People drink coffee. Or, you know, it, it just made sense. Mm -hmm. Is there anything that actually holds you back or inhibits you from getting started? So, as much as I see the opportunity and the money that you can make, I'm just really not a salesperson. Oh, wow. You know, and, and I know you're talking about you could pre-sell and you make it sound so easy, mm -hmm. and I think you could do it, but I don't know if I could do that. Got it. So, really, your, your number one concern is that you're, you feel like you're not a salesperson, right? Right. Is there anything else that would prevent you or stop you from getting started today? No, that would be the biggest thing. Okay. So, if I could show you how really there's going to be no selling done on your behalf, whereby you're feeling like you have to be something different than who you are. Mm -hmm. If I can show you that that was true and it was real and you believed it, are you ready to get yourself positioned if you felt like you didn't have to be a salesperson? If you, if you could show me. Okay. <laughs> if you could show me that, right. yeah. Let me give you an example. Um, do you drink coffee? No, actually I'm a tea drinker. Okay. So, you, so here's the one thing I want you to understand. You're never ever going to drink our coffee. The only thing we're going to ever give you is tea, because you don't drink coffee. So right off the bat, I want you to understand, we don't sell our product. I'm not a coffee drinker. So if a person doesn't drink it, we don't offer it. Does that make sense? Okay. How does that make you feel? Better. Okay. Now, let's talk about the opportunity. Watch this. Are you open to making more money? Absolutely. Great. I have a friend I'd like you to meet who's Mr. Moneybags. Okay. <laughs> yeah. And he's going to talk to you about how to make more money, because I don't, I don't have any money right now. How did that make you feel? See what I just did? I asked you, okay. are you open to making money? And you said yes. Yes. This time I want you to say no. Are you open to making more money? No. Great. Conversation's over. I want you to understand that the people who make money in this industry are not salespeople. Mm -hmm. People who go around trying to convince and persuade don't succeed at all in this business. Mm -hmm. People run from them, actually. This business is about sharing the product to those that want that particular product. Mm -hmm or sharing an opportunity to those that want that particular opportunity. Okay. And so, to, for me helping you, the way it would work, because you're a new person, mm -hmm. is you're going to introduce all of your people to me. Okay. And for about the first two, three to four weeks, I'm going to do all of the talking for you. It's kind of like OJT, on-the-job training, okay, great. but you're still getting paid. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to talk to all your people for you while you're being trained, and you'll see me talk to them and overcome their objections, etc. Does that make you feel a little bit better? Absolutely. Awesome. Let's go ahead and get you started, all right? Thank you. You feel a little bit better? Absolutely. Okay, good deal. All right, let's bring the next one up. All right, let's come over here, JP. So that was how you handled the not a salesperson. So we did the research, we did the salesperson, and we did the we did the no money, okay? So JP, nice to meet you. Hi, nice to meet you too. Good, 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 good. Tell me, man, it's a pleasure to be here. What did you like best about what you saw today? Uh, opportunity. It's knocking. 
opportunity. Yeah. You sound like a lady who's looking for opportunity. I am, you? absolutely. Tell me, awesome. You know, that was the same thing that got me as well, JP. Mm -hmm. Tell me, uh, what was your favorite part other than the opportunity? That was, or was that just it? Um, just having my free time, and I think it's brilliant that you guys took um, something healthy and stuck it in the biggest addiction. I, ag I agree 1,000% awesome. yep. with you. Well, tell me, is there anything that would hold you back from positioning yourself, getting started, if I agreed to help you out and, and help you get some money? I'd love to. I just, I, I, I don't even know if I have time. I've got twin boys, and we're always going to sports and school and work and everything. So I completely understand. Yeah. Tell me, is that the only thing that's actually holding you back? The fact that you don't yeah, have any time? Yeah, if you could buy me more time, that'd be great. Well, you know what? This is going to be a lot better than you thought. Once okay. This. Imagine how much more money you would make and, about, and imagine how much more freedom of time you would have if I did majority of all the work for you. Hmm. Okay. How does that make you feel? Curious. Okay. Well, that's how this business works, specifically in the beginning. You see, the reason why you don't have any time is because you don't have any leverage. All of the money you make is tied to your efforts, correct? Mm -hmm. Over here, when you sign up in this business, you have me and several other people that are in your upline of support that we have vested interests in your success, which means you could leverage us to actually do work for you while you get paid as well as us. Okay. How does that make you feel? Pretty good. Great. You ready to get started now? Absolutely. Great. Right, let's get you started. Okay. Awesome. Thanks. <laughs> you guys see this stuff? This stuff is simple. This stuff is simple. Overcoming the objections. Answer the question, close. You, you guys start to see a recurring theme of what I'm doing? Okay, you getting it? I know you are. Just keep watching it. Just keep watching it. Don't change the dial. You're getting it. You still got two more. All right, come on up here. Uh, come on up here. Uh, come on up here, uh, Vita. Come on up here, Vita. All right. All right, how you doing? Good. Good, good to see you. Good to see you. Tell me, uh, what did you like best about what it is you saw today? You know, it's coffee. I drink coffee. Everybody I know drinks coffee. It's you really look like a coffee drinker, actually. <laughs> How many cups of coffee do you drink a day? Just one. One? Just okay. one. That's oh, no, coffee's a good thing, especially when we're selling it. <laughs> right, right. So tell me, uh, is there anything else that, did you like the opportunity or just the product? Yeah, I mean, the opportunity, it yeah. makes a lot of sense. It okay. makes a lot of sense. It does. Mm -hmm. Tell me, is there anything that uh, holds you back or, you know, anything that would stop you today from getting started today and securing one of those top positions? Well, I mean, to be honest, mm -hmm. when you talked about that structure, you know, that pyramid thing, mm -hmm. I'm still not really comfortable about that. Okay. I know some of those are illegal, people lose a lot of money, only right. the people at the top make money, so right. I'm just not sure if that's something I want to get started with. Great. You know what? I completely understand how you feel. I used to feel the very same way. Okay? Um, are you open to an expert, someone that used to be you, that's no longer you? Are you open to me kind of helping you feel more comfortable about what it is, or should I not even waste my breath and you're just going to shut down? Well, I mean, you seem to be successful, and the person who invited me seems to be successful. So I, I want to know more, but I just wanted you to know what my concerns are. Okay. So if we can make you feel more comfortable about this illegal pyramid thing that's going on in your mind, mm -hmm. are you ready to get started? If you could feel, if you can get past that? If you could show me, yeah. Okay. Yeah. So is the real concern is that it's just a pyramid and you don't want to be involved in something illegal? Is that really it? That's really the that, That's really it. Okay. Yeah. So if we can show you documentation and things of that nature that shows it's a viable company, it's been around, third party documentation, multiple people of success, are those the types of things that would help you feel more comfortable? Yeah, that would have a lot. Okay, well, great. Hold on one second. Do you believe, have you ever read Success from Home Magazine? No. I you haven't. never heard of that? No. Oh, wow. Take a look at this. You, you do, what did you say you do for a living? I'm an attorney. Oh, ha, ha, ha. You're an attorney. Okay, well, listen here. This is, uh, just, if you mind, I'll teach you a few things. Of okay. Course. This is Success from Home. It's a third party magazine. And by the way, what, what date does that say there? March 2012. March 2012. And it talks about our company cover to cover. Now, this, you're saying Organo Gold didn't put this up. No, 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 no. This is all third party. Okay. This is not a matter of fact, you'll see people in here in this magazine that are not at our company and other ad disbursements and things of that nature. But cover to cover talks about us. Question. Do you I mean, I'm just asking, I want to know, do you believe that we could make it in this magazine if we were not above board, hadn't been fully checked out by all the regulators? You think that would be possible? Probably not. Okay. Fair. So does that kind of help chip away at some of the actual skepticism that you have already? This is a good start. It's a good start? Okay, mm -hmm. good. I'll put about 10%? <laughs> okay, 15%. Oh, I'll give you 15 Another Another 85 to go. <laughs> Should I get some water? <laughs> so we have that, and we have all sorts of other third-party documentation to show you the viability of our business. Okay, it's a real business. Okay. But back to the pyramid. I really want to just show you a couple things here. You, you said you're an attorney, right? So yes, do you, own, you work in a practice or do you own your own job? I own my own practice. You own. So this is you. 
you are the CEO, am I right? That's right. And underneath you, I would imagine you might have an executive vice president or something like that. Is that true? Or is just employees. Just, uh, uh, so you mean there's it's just there, there's nobody. It's just wow. So that means it's just you here. Yeah. And how many employees do you have? Three. Three. So it kind of looks like this, right? Yeah. Wait a minute. Well, if we kind of outline that. Ah, uh, no, that's clever. Is that a pyramid? Yep, that is a pyramid. No wonder why you think all the people at the top make all the money, because you're at the top. <laughs> right? That's true in my case, yes. I get it, I get it. Okay, well, let me explain how this is a little bit different. A little bit different. Okay, so over here, this is you in Organo Gold, mm -hmm. and you are a CEO, okay? Mm -hmm. And as we introduce the business to other people, they're not going to be employees. They also are CEOs as well. And so everyone that we introduce the business to, they own their own franchise, quote unquote. Does that make sense? That makes sense. And they have the earning potential to out-earn you if they decide to build a larger team and produce more volume. Does that make sense? Okay. The, value, the benefit to you is that you will still earn a small percentage of everything that they do. Because I introduced them. Correct. Okay. So unlike where you work here, you have zero leverage. Am I right? Because if you're not there, you're the only person at the top. Exactly. No work really gets done. Is That's that true? That's for sure. That's for sure, yeah. Over here, how does it sound and make you feel to get paid a percentage of multiple hundreds and thousands of people's efforts? Which one do you think would not only make you more money over time, but also give you more freedom of time? That's true. This one definitely. I can, Let me see, ask that. You. I can see that. Does that make you feel a little bit more comfortable along with more documentation that we can give you? Yeah. Great. That's, that's now. Great. Is that pretty helpful? It is. Yeah. As it relates to making money, uh, your first month, would you like to build this business slow or would you like to make it fast? Which one? Definitely fast. Okay. If I were to work with you, uh, how does making an extra $3,000 sound this month? That would be great. Pretty good? Get, it, great. get a nice little start? Right. To make an extra $3,000, would you be willing to follow simple instructions? Sure. Okay. All I want you to do is build a list of contacts and introduce me to all of your people. I know you're an attorney. You probably don't need me speaking for you. but I like to just kind of train you to get you feeling more and more comfortable about how this works and also put money in your pocket at the same time. Are you okay with that? I'm okay with that. Introduce all of your people to me and I'll do all the talking for you, okay? Okay. Last thing I want you to do is I simply want you to just make two thirds of your money right back within set within 72 hours or less. That way you got a quick start. How does that make you feel? Great. How do I do that? I'm going to show you how to pre-sell. It's just coffee. So we're going to show you how to pre-sell the coffee that you're signing up for simply by calling in some favors real quick. Uh, it's 15 people buying a couple boxes each. You'll make your money back within the first several days. Okay. Makes sense? That's doable. I mean, it's so nice to meet you. I look forward to working with you. Let's go ahead and get you started. All right. That's right. awesome. All right. And then we have, uh, so we, we pretty much, we've done the pyramid. Okay. We've done the, we, we've done the pyramid. We've done the no time. We've done the no money. We've done the research. And we've done the salesperson. Okay. Now, last one to do is here, how we're going to do the spouse. All right. So let's come on up here. We're going to bring up, uh, what do you have here? We have Matt. Okay, we have Matt. All right, all right, come on up here, Matt. <laughs> Wait, now, you guys haven't seen Hulk. I mean, you haven't seen Matt here. This is Matt. Matt, let everybody know your name and where you're from and, and uh, what your background was and how long you've been in Organo Gold. Uh, Matthew Sterling Fuller. Uh, my background is in construction. I've uh, been around for about 90 days, Organo Gold from Sacramento, California. And, uh, and what's, what do you like best about Organo Gold? Simplicity. Simplicity. All right. Simple. Well, Matt, we're going to go ahead and just got one last objection to overcome, and we're going to knock it out. All right? So, man, listen, it's a privilege to meet you, man. I'm glad you, uh, nice to meet you here. Uh, tell me, man, what, what was it that, uh, what did you like the best about uh, what you just heard tonight? Everything. You liked everything? Everything. You know, that's how I felt when I saw it, too. Yeah. Yeah. Was there anything that, uh, any quite, anything holding you back from positioning yourself tonight to get started? Um, I just don't do anything until I run it by my wife. So awesome. I have to just go home and you know, let her know what's going on. I completely understand, man. They say happy wife, happy life. Is that true? Yeah. Awesome. Yeah, I've heard about that. Tell me, you guys have kids? Yep. Awesome. Well, listen, man. Um, tell me. I know that you're married, mm -hmm. and that you know she's half of the house. I get it. But you being the other half, did you enjoy what it was you saw? Absolutely. So is it safe to say that fifty percent of the house is sold? Yeah. Okay. Well, what do you think about you and I working together to acquire the other 50%, in other words, to get her on board? What do you think about that? Yeah, absolutely. Let me tell you how this works. 
I want you to do what you do best, which is love your wife, right? Let me do what I do best, which is I'm a professional at this business. Let me explain this business, okay? I want you to go ahead, and I'm going to give you a DVD, so that way you won't have to do all the explaining, okay? But I want you to let her know you saw something that was really exciting, but most importantly, you met someone that you really felt you connected with. Can you do that? Absolutely. Have her watch this video right here. This is my partner. He's going to explain everything in 30 minutes or less. He's a multi-multi-millionaire in this business and has taught me everything I know. So this is the guy that taught me everything I know. Okay? It's 30 minutes, and after your wife takes a look at this, why don't you go ahead, I'll leave my phone open to you tonight. You guys call me, okay? And I'll talk with her, answer questions, and we'll build a game plan for y'all success from there. Is that okay? Yeah. Does that make you feel all right? Yeah. All right, man. It was a pleasure meeting you. Here's a DVD and my number. I'll talk to you tonight. All right, great. Thank you. All right, guys, there you have it. How to close. No excuses. Your turn.